Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read for you coming from Pisces, your weekly horoscope from the 26th of March to the 31st of March 2017. Let's start with Sunday the 26th. Sunday the 26th doesn't start very well for you. Frustration, depression can await you. This couple of planets there are very slow. So they bring delays, they bring dis uh, disappointments in what you want. And so you will be wanting to be pushy and want quick results because you have planets in Pisces that make you behave that way. Don't allow that. Be patient because the more you, more you prod in the morning afternoon sessions, you only get response which is not good. And watch out that somebody you know from the past may visit you or contact you and you are not very happy about it or that a problem from the past may also be very disturbing. So morning and afternoon sessions, pretty depressive, slow and frustrating. So go slow, go slow. The evening period and the afternoon, sorry, the eve, uh, late afternoon, evening and night period becomes a little better. But now there, there is one planet here that makes you very dominating, very stubborn, very pushy, very prodding kind of a person. So don't want to do that. And this planet can make you very argumentative as well. So all these things await you in the late afternoon, evening and night period. And if you don't listen to me, you are going to find that if you are looking for romance, you get it and it's not very good, disappointing because of your behavior. If you are out with your marriage partner, your marriage partner may think you are too pushy and dominating and not, so be not cooperative. And if you are socializing even with your bosses or with your potential business people or colleagues, the, as long as you dominate, and be stubborn, the situation will always turn bad. So don't do that. Do the opposite. Be um, um, spontaneously good. Be kind. Be agreeable, most of all. And the evening can give you some benefits and a nightfall too. Monday the 27th for you in Pisces, there is a planet that makes you very aggressive. And it's a planet that makes you use words which are very harsh. And it's a pleasant that makes you very determined as well to get what you want. So you will be like a bull in a china shop, just going out to grab what you want. Don't do that. Try to be calm. Try to be polite. Try to be gracious. And take the soft approach. And this way you will really be get, getting something at least worthwhile. The evening sessions and the nightfall sessions turn bad against you. Now the situation becomes rebellious because you are becoming rebellious. You are becoming radical, like non-conformist uh, non and not wanting to agree with others. And you're going off on a level where others, others don't understand your behavior. That's the evening and nightfall session. This planet is also there in the morning and afternoon session, but he's, he's only in and out. So he makes a little bit problems here and there for you. But during the evening and nightfall, he's there all the time. So don't allow him to make you rebellious or make you radical in the sense of being very revolutionary and non-conformist. Try to be a part of the team, be agreeable and that way you will make the night fall even better. Tuesday the 28th is where your ego plays a lot and you will feel very sensitive and you want to lead and you want to take credit and you want to be recognized. All these feelings will be there probably because you're doing something good. But this planet of ego is not doing very well in, in your Pisces. And so this planet of ego can make you very arrogant, can isolate you because you don't want to cooperate or you feel that unless you do it yourself, it won't be done well. And this planet can make you behave that way. So others will feel you as very arrogant and will not help to support you whether in areas of marriage or romance or in um, a career or business. So don't be arrogant. Now as the late afternoon and evening period comes, one nasty planet is there who makes you think in a nasty way, makes you very arrogant and makes you criticize other people a lot and makes you very argumentative and debating and you will find differences and problems with other people. It's that kind of a severe planet. This planet is also there in the morning afternoon session, but only little bits here and there, creating problems a little bit here and there. 
but during the evening and nightfall session this planet is very active so you have to worry that situation can get very bad in any area of your life so don't argue don't be confrontational don't be provocative most of all and you will bring the situation to your better level and there's a lot of speed in this planet so you may drive fast you may talk fast you may walk fast so little accidents are also possible wednesday the 29th a much much better day and it's a very peaceful and loving day from morning noon and night and you are very imaginative and very creative and you are very supportive and loved by most people in all areas whether in a marriage or romance or career or business you attract support so in your career you will find that support from your bosses is very nice you there's a slight change there which is for your better and there's also your imagination uh, creating reward for yourself and if you are in business you can find new partners in business or you can find new business possibilities and you'll be able your imagination and creativity to score and win contracts and win make new contacts very inspired by you so be active morning noon and night and this way you will do well if you're looking for romance this is really a perfect day to go searching for one communicate as much as you can and you there will be a result to your favor don't worry so a good day and it ends very beautifully for you as well so socialize thursday the 30th uh, the 30th for pisces so some planets which are very disagreeable making you dominating making you difficult basically very stubborn and uh, disagreeable is there so try to do the opposite be approachable be negotiating easily and be a person who uh, willing to work with others and you can improve the outlook for your morning and afternoon session as the time goes on to the evening and the night fall the situation comes very well for you in fact this one planet which is going to give you a lot of reward during the late afternoon evening and night fall is also there in the morning afternoon session but he is being nudged here and there he cannot settle down so you will have little bits of good news here and there but the real continuity comes in the evening a uh, late afternoon evening and nightfall session so socialize take your marriage partner out and you'll find solutions of all kind and be very happy take your romance partner out and you see the bonding will be good and it's a good time to look for romance if you don't have one and go out with your colleagues or with your bosses you will get only good news coming your way and in business areas there's something about a foreign nature you either are going to contact somebody foreign wise or get foreign news is from a foreign person or somebody of another race so this sort of planet is also seen very strong so go on the internet perhaps or you may meet somebody while socializing who is a foreigner or somebody of another race that meeting i would say is very good you are somehow inspired in the evening session so you will have this spots of inspiration in what you say friday the 31st turns to be a quite a nasty day and it starts with a lot of sudden and unexpected issues coming up it makes you behave rebelliously so before you leave home there's already a problem created so you don't have to create it don't be rebellious don't say things which others don't like to hear don't don't create anxiety and stress and this way when you leave the home things are still okay at your place of work if you have a career you are going to feel a lot of unexpected issues which are not very good for you the news itself may come very fast and very quickly so watch out that a mistake can lead to a lot of unexpected dangers so you cannot afford to be behaving rebelliously you have to follow rules and regulations this is the planet who makes you not care for rules and regulations and makes you therefore go and do things as you want and the bosses will turn against you or your colleagues may turn against you If you are in business be careful that a uh, one little mistake made one little thing said wrong and very quickly you get bad news in business and you cannot afford to try your luck in a radical radical is simply a non-conformist way a rebellious way you cannot afford to do that you have to allow traditional values to be also there on this 31st the evening and the night fall period doesn't improve very much now it shows depression it shows that the problems created earlier are going to be seen to be elongated 
for a week or whatever it is. So the mistakes made earlier on Friday the 31st, you can have to pay dearly already in the evening and nightfall session. If you are socializing, watch out that something wrong said and the evening can end up in a very bad way. So perhaps if you don't have to socialize, don't. And also somebody from your past or somebody that you have known in your past or something you did of your past, this kind of things can come back to trouble you in the night session. So it's a depressive period basically. Now I'm already Skyping and I charge USD 50, 50 for a 90 minute Skype consultation based on your full date of birth and time of birth and also looking at your palms. And in those 90 minutes, I will give you a lot of news. I will talk to you about your next five or six years in detail in all areas of your life, your career, your business, your health, your personal areas. And uh, I will advise you in your health. I will scan your whole body in a way to know where your problems are. And if something is going to trouble you 15, 20 years from now, I will identify it already early. So what I do is early detection. And that's what saves lives and uh, knowing things already way ahead you can repair them while you're very strong there's no second or third or fourth stage anymore and you can lead a very healthy life i've done it for people so i hope we can skype one day i want to help you i, I do i like people from pisces very much i know how loyal they can be and i know how supportive they can be i also know how argumentative they can be but try to control that part of it so I look forward to one day, go to Facebook and look me up and um, communicate with me and ask me questions and maybe one day we make an arrangement either on through Facebook or through YouTube. You can also send me a message. Okay? Until then, I wish you the best of luck and a good week. Thank you and goodbye.